Tonight's the night. Tonight's the night. Dua Lipa. Yeah, I am going to Dua Lipa today. Going by myself since both my best friends actually ended up being busy today. So going on a solo trip. I feel like there's just this stigma of having to go to concerts in a group or something. When actually it's totally fine to go to concerts by yourself and it should totally be normalized. You don't need to go to a concert with a big group of people who you end up losing anyways. Prioritize whatever you want. It's totally fine to go to a concert by yourself. When you're at a concert, you should really just be focused on you and the artist. So it's like all these other people, they don't even matter. It's just you and them. And that's how you really enjoy the music. Mwah. And it's not like I haven't gone to concerts by myself before. Just I haven't really gone in a long time. Either way, I'm super psyched to go. And really the only thing standing in between me and the concert is eight hours of time and seven hours. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get ready now. It's such a nice day and I'm gonna waste it being inside in a dimly lit arena. But actually though, the, the concert was actually in Climate Pledge Arena and I've never been in there. I went in there when it was Key Arena, but I mean, I don't know. I feel like I'm also low-key underselling how hyped I am for Dua Lipa. She's literally like one of my favorite artists that isn't a DJ. So I'm... Subscribed. I guess another benefit of going to concerts alone is that you get to decide when you want to leave. You don't have to wait for anyone. You can go whenever. In this case, I'm heading out a little early for once to try and get to the front row, maybe? We'll see. How's it going? Okay, I'm at the show. Got merch. About to go back to the floor. That was probably one of the best shows I've been to in a while. I think I'm gonna call it here.